Welcome to my studio. Thank you. Uh, Beautiful studio. Thank you. Uh, my name is Aya Bauer, and I wanted to welcome everybody, all the loyal art lovers who weren't able to come to the open studios this year. Um, welcome. And uh, uh, let's see. I'm, yeah, an what? <laughs> I'm an abstract painter. Uh, I work primarily in oil, in acrylic, and some mixed media. Uh, and I tend to like to let the art do the speaking, but I will share that I'm inspired by nature, by our relationship to nature. I'm very moved by the fluidity of organic lines and curves, ever-changing light and the energy that moves through all living things. I get very excited when people see the work and take a deep breath and say that it either calms them or soothes them or takes them on their own personal journey. You're working on these two right now? These two are sort of works in progress. Uh, this one is very, I think this one's finished. This one is still waiting. It doesn't know where it wants to go yet. So I'm waiting <laughs> for that to, to become a little bit clearer. I tend to name most of my works uh, in French. Uh, mm -hmm. I lived abroad for 10 years and French names seem to be what come to me. Uh, you'll notice I am very enamored with rayures, stripes. Uh, I love the way they reflect the constant of the horizon line and the light of the both the California coast as well as the, the southern European, southern France. And you might notice over here, Paula, I have uh, quite a few works that are either representational nests oh. and Paris. And nests have had a very uh, symbolic meaning for me. This one is called Le Nid Ephemer, the ephemeral nest. And as I have moved many times, up to 20 times in 20 years with eight of those international, um, I love how nests represent the ephemeral nature of life. Mm, beautiful. And Thanks. for some people, they represent family and coziness. And uh, I think that's about it. But thank you so much for thank coming. Thank you so much for showing us your work. And uh, we hope next year that viewers will be able to come see it in person. Thank you. Thank you, Paul.